Hey, hello, lovely viewers. You're watching by Polar Opposites. I'm your guy, Tim Cullen. Today, I will be talking to you about baby and animal talk. Okay. Who here has kids? Okay. You know when you're the kids and you're the little baby? You got the little baby. And what do you do? You talk baby talk. Coochie, coochie, coochie. Coochie, coochie, coochie. I don't know. I don't have kids at this point, so I don't know how that works. But I know that... People talk down to babies because they think, oh, they're little babies, they don't understand what we're going to say, so we gotta come up with a little made-up language. Now, if you really think about it, if you were to be transported into a baby's body, how are they thinking? Would you think, coochie, 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 was good? Well, apparently, we think babies understand it better because they don't have the brain capacity that we adults have, which is kind of insulting. If you really think about it, I mean, we're talking to little babies like they're stupid. But, let's talk about animals. I do have animals, like, you know when you have a good dog, and like a good boy dog, and he's a really, really good boy? Who's a good doggy? Who's a good doggy? You're a good doggy! I mean, come on. Who's guilty of that? Come on, y'all know that you, if you own a dog, and you're, it's a really good dog, you say, who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Or, who's a good girl? Who's a good girl? Alright? Mean, even if I'm being dragged walk over there, I say, whenever I dress him, I say, Hello! Like he's a baby. Now, as for being a dragon's comprehension in English, or whatever language you speak, then, I don't, I don't know how much I understand. I mean, people say I only say like a certain number of words, but, you know, again, we assume that, okay, because they're limited in brain capacity, that they're stupid and they understand stuff better. Or even my cat Rose. I call it Woody Woody. Who's a good little Woody Woody? Now, imagine being put in a cat's body, a cat named Rose, and you're being called a Woozy Woozy. I know I'm guilty, but I can't help it. I mean, it just it just happens. That's the way we work. I mean, that's how human beings are. We just assume that any lower beings are stupid, and therefore having baby or animal talk works. Now, yes, I admit I'm guilty. I call my animals weird names, like Waka is just Waka, or Eat the Waka! You know, all kinds of stupid things, but, you know, that's just how we are. That's how we talk down to babies and animals. Why do we do that? I don't know. Like I said, I think it might have to do with us considering they have limited brain capacity. Whatever. Till next time, I'm coming. Out.